All right, I wanted to try a little experiment. As uh, you can see here, I have a lot of these frames rendered. And originally the simulation was only gonna be up to 1,140 frames, which my computer finished rendering this morning at 5, 5.14 a.m. Well, when, once I got up this morning, I watched a simulation and I decided I needed probably about 200 more frames. <coughs> so basically go up to uh, 1340. All right. So I went ahead and since I, this is a flip fluids simulation, you can resume baking. All you have to do is just add a higher number to your end frame count and then resume baking and then you can add more simulation to it but I got thinking because I knew it was going to take probably two hours to uh, bake those extra 200 frames so I got thinking what happens if I use the command line and tell it to start use tell it to use the command line to finish the baking by launching the command line bake function and then just wait till it, till it um, you know bakes a few frames because every time it bakes a frame it literally saves the uh, it, it doesn't save the file but the way it's organized it understands that those frames are baked so I gotta think of what happens if I let the bake get a few frames ahead and then I launch the command line renderer. Basically the render will be chasing the bake, if you know what I mean. Because it's not completely baked yet all the way to uh, 1340. Let me show you what I mean. I can go ahead and close this because it's all doing in the background. ROM 1, this is it. Alright, this right here is the bake. And as you, as you can see, it's up to 12, it's currently baking frame 1286. And this right here is rendering. Now this right here is lagging this one, obviously, because it can't, it can't, this cannot uh, render faster than this can bake, obviously. Otherwise, I would run into um, issues where the there are no bake files. But this is at 1287 and this is probably baking maybe three times faster than it's rendering and this is up to 1147 so literally as this is baking this is rendering it's the same project file and instead of having to wait for this to finish baking because the way the command line works and because of the way um, flip fluids work I believe it's something, I believe they're using a, a specific script um, when it comes to flip fluids that probably allows this. I'm not 100% sure. A lot of this stuff is way over my head. But it's just interesting that while this is baking the simulation, this can actually go ahead and start rendering as this is baking. That way you don't have to wait till it gets finished baking and then start rendering. Yeah, that's interesting. I just thought I'd share that because I thought that was interesting. Anyway, later, people.